We're playing Five Nights at Freddy's 3. It has been widely actually suggested by the community, and I think it's because of how accepting of a game it is. I mean, it's pretty cool for them to cast Michael J. Fox as Springtrap in this. That's pretty epic. I mean, you're able to kind of see the uh, method performance here, and it's, there we go. Right Are you there. being yeah. racist? No. How is that being racist? Michael J. Fox is white. You can't be you racist, can't be to, racist white to white people. people. You can't oppress the oppressors, Jill. There's no such thing. Get with the times. I was thinking of somebody else. If you see a white person, Jill, you have full license to murder them. Jill, if you thought of someone else when I said Michael J. Fox, that makes you racist. Wow. I'm sorry. Fazbear's Fright, the horror attraction. Local amusement park is getting ready to scare your cocks Cox off, off. Oh. with a new attraction based on the unsolved mysteries of Freddy Fazbear. They didn't even give you enough time to read it. Pizza. Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. So do you think do you think the Freddy in this is actually Freddy Mercury? Yes. Yeah. Okay. It's a lot of method acting, I'm telling you right now. <laughs> Wait, wait, wait. They're featuring actual relics from the decades-old pizzeria. So there's real stuff here from the original. There's, like, dead children. Too. Hot. Hey, we have a cerebellum. It's pretty cool. <laughs> anyway, want to buy a pizza? Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, hey, glad you came back for another night. I promise it'll be a lot more interesting this time. We found some, some great new relics over the weekend, and we're out tracking down a new lead right now. So uh, let me just update you real quick, then you can get to work. Like the attraction opens in like a week, so we have to make sure everything works and nothing catches on fire. Uh, when the place opens, people will come in at the opposite end of the building and work their way toward you, then past you and out the exit. Uh, yeah, you've officially become part of the attraction. Uh, you'll be starring as a security guard. So not only will you be monitoring the on the camera as they pass through, you know, to make sure no one steals anything or makes out in the corner, but you'll also be a part of the show. It'll make it feel really authentic, I think. Uh, now let me tell you about what's new. We found another set of drawings, always nice, and a boxy head, which we think could be authentic. Then again, it might just be another crappy cosplay. And we found a desk fan, very old school, metal though. So watch the fingers. Uh, <laughs> Uh, right now the place is basically just, you know, flashing lights and spooky props. Uh, I honestly thought we'd have more by now. Uh, if we don't have something really cool by next week, then we may have to suit you up in a furry suit and make you walk around saying, Boo! <laughs> uh, but, you know, like I said, we're trying to track down a good lead right now. Uh, some guy who helped design one of the buildings says it was like an extra room that got boarded up or uh, something like that. So, we're gonna take a peek so those are your cameras. If you go to the other setting, I think you might have like um. I forget what it is, but it's something. Click that blue button. You can toggle between the hall cams and the vent cams. Then over to your far left, you can flip up your maintenance panel. You know, use this to reboot any systems that may go offline. In trying to make the place feel vintage, we may have overdone it a bit. Some of this equipment is barely functional. Yeah, I wasn't joking about the fire. That's, that's, that's a real risk. Uh, the most important thing you want to watch for is the ventilation. Look, this place will give you the spooks, man. And if you let that ventilation go off wide, then you'll start seeing some crazy stuff, man. Keep that air flowing. Okay, keep an eye on things, and we'll try to have something new for you tomorrow night. So it's literally 4 a.m. by the time that guy stopped talking. Yeah, but it was only a minute or two. In our time. Yeah, a minute or two is long for you in bed, but that's short for me in bed. Look, just because I'm the fastest man alive in all facets doesn't mean you need to shame me like this. That's true. Audio devices? You only have to reboot them when it says they're down. No, I know. I just wanted to know what it was. Okay. Try rebooting all. Do you have, like, a flashlight? A flashlight? I, I mean... do not have a flashlight. So, I'm pretty sure you have to press, like, B on the cameras to make... Hi. America Great Again? <laughs> oh. No, what? you you the make a sound out. and then um, Springtrap will be lured over there and you have to try and keep him away from you because there's no way to close the door. Do you have to like uh, lure him into traps? Uh, kind of. More like just like luring him away from you for the whole night. You so, can't really do anything so do else. You have, do you have a flashlight though? No, I've no. told you a few times okay. I don't have one. I didn't. What kind of answer? You have to bring your own. 
I couldn't hear because I have like headphones on and like literally the most talkative man alive on the phone. Well, yeah, and we also have the lore expert over on the right the from, from Markiplier. <laughs> I watch Mark's Pliers do this. Video. Well, I really liked Markiplier back in the day. I still like hey, Markiplier. Nice. What's wrong with Markiplier? Nice. Oh, there's nothing wrong with him. Oh, I just man. haven't watched him as much lately. I might be the best FNAF player on the planet. You are great. I didn't even need You're to gonna check take the, the camera. That is how good I am. Whoa, what is this? Uh, this is the part of the game where you get that flashlight. Uh, oh! Oh, they're sexy. Oh, Golden Freddy. All right, what's going on? Oh, I don't want to touch that. Don't touch that. Oh, those are mice. You can't touch the mice. Probably can't. Oh, the, wait, who wait, is there's that? there's the purple... The purple people eater? Oh, oh, jeez. Come on, come on, come on, come on, These things are so cool. I love these, like, mini games. Oh, wait, you can touch the mice. What is it said? Follow me? Hmm? Follow me. And Follow you'll me. see... A world of children that are dead. <laughs> oh, I'm following him. Hey, he's gonna buddy. show you his purple pee pee. <laughs> hey, I, I, show I me, show me your little purple man. <laughs> your little bear. Why did you say ear? Oh, error, error. error. Okay. Ear. Oh, whoa, whoa! Why is did he, he like touching me? you? We have like Larry Nasser. Is that who oh that my is? Gosh, I thought he just killed the kid. Is that like Larry Nasser and Bill Cosby's son? I feel like they. Yeah, it was. They rebooted him. This is reboot Freddy. Like from oh. from uh, Nightmare on Elm Street, where he actually is a confirmed hey, child hey, grabber. I have some awesome news for you. First of all, we found some vintage audio training cassettes. Dude, these are like prehistoric. I think they were like training tapes. Or, like, is that spring trap? Is that actually spring trap? Like so yes. I thought oh. we could like have them playing like over the speakers as people walk through the attraction. Dude, that makes this feel legit, man. But I have an even better surprise for you. <laughs> You're not gonna believe this. We found one. A real one. Uh, 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 gotta go, man. Uh, well, well look, it, it's in there somewhere. I, I'm sure you'll see it. Okay, I'll leave you with some of this great audio that I found. Talk to you later, man. Does your camera run out of battery in hello, this? Hello. No, it just will break and you have to reboot it. But it'll tell you when it's broken. Uh, these tanks will provide you with much needed information on how to handle... It's just staticky like that because Scott Cawthon was too busy putting all of his money into the Republican Foundation to get good cameras. Oh, he's right there! Lure him away! I can't! So he came up to you? Uh... So you're gonna die? Is that what Hey, buddy! Just go to the cameras! <laughs> Lure him. Press, some, press audio somewhere. Ventilation air. He's, you have to repair. Repair, re reboot all. Oh, uh, oh no. Is he right outside this? Mm. You're gonna die. I'm trying. So, usually when he's like in the room next to you, you can do the audio on the room next to the room he's in and it'll lure him fast. Oh, jeez! So, like, try doing audio on like the room yeah. near you guys. Hi! I did. Oh, he blown away. Good. Good. That's good. Oh my gosh. Oh my. Okay. That wasn't a very scary jump scare. I wanted it to be scarier. Well, what'd you want him to do? Like, like jump on you, you and like yeah. thrust you like you did to that kid in the purple? Yeah. Day? <laughs> Come on. What's like, the what's the deal with why this? Why is this not rated AO? Come on, Scott. I thought this was what was supposed to be the scariest. I need you to put my dick in a coffin. <laughs> I like Jill's comment. He was too busy redirecting game funds to the, to the Republican Party. <laughs> Yeah, you guys didn't even laugh at that, though. I heard it. I was trying to fight for my life here. It just took a couple seconds to register. Yeah, we're not that smart. Like me registering with the Republican National Commission. Or like me being registered on the sex offender list. Mm-hmm. Um. You want to share? And no, they call me... Your J secrets, so I can join. They call me Jay Springtrap. <laughs> the reason I fell in love with him is because he was on that list. Oh, happy. Wow. <laughs> Yeah, you're kind of like those people who fall in love with the, um, <laughs> with, like, the serial killers Like in Stockholm Syndrome? Oh, like, literally every white girl around that falls <laughs> in love with, like, Ted Bundy. Uh-huh. Or it's like, oh, he was so misunderstood. But he's hot! I want him to chase me around in the woods like he did those other girls he killed. It's because he loved them. <laughs> I bet he really loves everyone. Oh, oh. <laughs> Try pressing audio. Is he in the room where it happened? What? What room? Oh, I can't. Also, okay. I, I like the Freddy Fazbear um, 
Funko Pops there. Is that? Whoa, whoa! Jeez, what was that? That was uh, Balloon Boy. It's the vent. Cause you have to. Oh man, you have to do the vents. Because okay, so here's the thing with this: Springtrap is the only real threat here. Okay. Um, I think you might be able to pass out. Mm. Oh, jeez! Yeah, you can pass out from lack of oxygen, and ba Balloon Boy will just kind of show up and have funsies with you, like, underneath wow. your oh, desk. Oh, my. But wow. he doesn't really kill Balloon you. Balloon Boy is underage, Jill. He just wants to hang Audio out. Audio error. Audio error. God, this guy's a dick. Why? Because he keeps ruining my audio. I paid a lot for those. That's true. You paid a lot for your two sets of headphones that we have to share. I had to take literally ten dollars away from the Republican Party. <laughs> oh no! In order to fund these <laughs> headphones. Where's Donald Trump going to get his money now? <laughs> Gosh, who knows? That's why he didn't win. <laughs> he didn't have that ten dollars. Yeah, you bought exactly. those headphones. Guys, when I'm ultimately canceled for that joke, I've got to tell you, I've already set up a replacement to run the channel for me. Epic. Is kind that of, me? No, no, not at all. Uh, kind of like how Scott and had to pick a replacement because people were butthurt that he might have a different opinion. I thought I got the Well, he needs to have died. the same opinion as everyone else. If Scott Cawthon does not put Joe Biden in the next game as a as the hero... Hello. Right. And then he stays canceled. He should be doxxed. Well, if Scott Cawthon does not believe everything I believe, I'm going to kill him. <laughs> With words on Twitter. Oh, okay. I'm not, I'm not threatening him. Yeah, I got no. it. You're not actually like a, a very uh, intimidating person. You just are going to kill him. Right. Think you're, you think I'm just going to. I'm just going to whip out the old keyboard. Oh no! Don't whip out anything. <laughs> I'm going to whip it out. <laughs> oh, somebody busted the audio. Like busting a nut. Ah uh, yeah. Springtrap yeah. does that all the time. That's where he got his name from, actually. <laughs> you actually he springs his trap. You guys actually haven't looked at the Oh jeez. Um press audio on something. Hi. Oh, ventilation error. You guys actually haven't seen the real name to this. It's five nuts at Freddy's. <laughs> you have to be able to come once a night every night. Well, and Balloon like, Boy can help out with that. Why isn't he leaving? Actually, you're Hi. busy being um, Balloon Boyed in the butt. Balloon and boyed. Until you can get Spring Trap to do his spring. Mm -hmm. And if you can't do that in time, then you get, you know, killed by Balloon Boy. Why won't you leave, man? I was referencing a uh, Try song and, like, movie. Camera 5. That we watched. Unofficial. Uh, Cam 5. There you go. Oh, he's moving! I just saw him moving! He did, yeah. Is he... Did he move to a different area? Now that... I am unsure. I wonder if he went to... Oh, man. Why can't you, like, lure him to... Oh, audio device. I know, I need to reboot it. I, I didn't hear your joke. What'd you say? When I, I was making a reference to the saw porn that we watched, oh. Balloon Boy <laughs> yeah. is the, the we machine. Found, Jill and I found an unofficial saw adult parody. Oh, really? <laughs> and um, so I'm, I'm thinking about how to say this without getting demonetized. Right. In the saw adult parody, what happens is Jigsaw. Oh, jeez. He, um, He's right around the corner. I he know. captures a woman. I and saw him run in the build at the room. He like rigs up this machine that um, you I know. pressed it. I, I don't know. know how to get rid of him. So basically, okay, let, it, let me explain. No, no, no. Let me explain it, Joel. Oh, okay. you, you, you're not the star of this show. I, I am. To be this Nate, you should try this. Okay. So basically, what happens is that Jigsaw rigs up a trap where a girl is tied down without any clothes on. And I would say the trap is placed into an orifice on her body, but it, it's, and it keeps yes. poking her, like how like how Mark Zuckerberg pokes everyone on Facebook. It's her butt. This this thing keeps poking her. Okay. Okay. And it will poke faster and faster until she helps a man with her other orifice reach the climax of his story. <laughs> reach the third act of his story. And, and he has a really hard time getting to the third yeah, act. Yeah, he has, well, he's he's very uh, tolerant. And she, he's like the tolerant left. And she has oh, to basically like get him. Left. Wait, wait, how'd you do that? Other she part? has to get him to spring his Map trap. toggle? Press that again. Right? Yeah, you can like seal some vents. Oh! I didn't know you could do that. Yeah, so she either. has to spring his trap. And if she doesn't, 
Mark Zuckerberg will poke her harder and faster. Mark <laughs> Zuckerberg? Yeah, until she dies. Facebook poking her until it kills her. <laughs> Whoa. And, like, in the adult parody, when she... the vents. When she's, like, succeeded in her trap, you, you see her in the hospital <laughs> with um, her showing, you know, where she was... Uh, Facebook poked. Yeah, mutilated. Oh, well, no. I mean... She was just Facebook poked. Yeah, sure. And then the detective is like checking it out and he's like, ooh, hey. Ooh, hey. Hi. He's like, can I get in on this? You're already pre stretched. Okay, Jill. What? There's a thing about like taking jokes too far that you do on this channel. What? That one was funny. That you're doing. Was it? Yeah. Will it be funny when we get demonetized? That one can't get us demonetized. All I did was say stretch. Will it be. Is it wrong of me to do yoga? Will it be. <laughs> I think We're, so, yeah. Not, yeah, yoga's disgusting. I don't believe in God. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't believe in God. <laughs> you better be careful. Last time you made fun of God, your wheel broke on your chair. That is... I wouldn't say I made uh, fun of God. I <laughs> that would is say, true, actually. I would say that I was helping him out. I'm trying to switch the camera. There's too many buttons to remember. What is going on here? Uh, check the... Yep, ventilation. Oh my goodness. See, this is really difficult. We're on night two. I told you this is the hardest in the series. I thought you said this was the easiest. Yeah, I thought you said this was the easiest too. Uh, yeah, that's what they said. They said it's way easier than two. I wonder if there's any tips. Like they say, like uh, always seal like vent twelve or something. Maybe just you and Nate are, um, you know, those kids that were in school that nobody ever got to see because they were in a special room. Wow. What is wrong with you? Jeez. <laughs> Was I not allowed to say that? That's a little far. You think Jill, so? that, that's a little mean. Yeah, Jill. Why do you come on the Let's Play channel and you try and be mean? I was just saying you guys yeah. needed to learn English when you came here. Wow. Wow. So now you're wow. attacking now you're attacking immigrants. Wow. Hello. I love all people. I would just like to get that out there before Jill gets me in trouble. For some reason, I don't know if they did that here, Hello. but in my public school in Maine. What? What did they do in your public school in Maine? Hold on, I'll read this in a second that you're showing me. Um, in my public school in Maine, they Hello. would um, have like all of the... There was a lot of Muslim immigrants for some reason where I lived. And for some reason, they would going? like have the Muslim immigrants, especially the girls, like, not be around the rest of us. And they kind of played it off like it was just them being in different classes to learn English. But I kind of feel like there was, like, some secret racism going on in my school. Because, <laughs> like, they they wouldn't, um... Hi. They, they didn't have them co-exist with the the rest of the kids, and I thought it was very odd. But you have, like, Arthur America? Like, <laughs> running, it's like, let's just say they have an explosive personality. Or, like, he said something really racist. It was, like, really oh, weird. No. And you're just like, ah. Uh. Oh, no. <laughs> Look, I'm speaking as Arthur America. I'm not saying that. Right, right. You're, that, you're just cosplaying. Or he's like, I, I mean... They have a thing with going in the pool. It's like, we don't have a pool at gym class. There's no pool. Yeah, there's no pool. Oh. <laughs> I think that might be um, different now that there's a new you want to try? Yeah, I can try. Well, Nate, why don't you, well, you can try. Why don't you look up tips, Nate? Yeah, anyway, there's a new principal now at my old school that ran the alternative school that I went to after I went to the high school because I, like, I didn't like my high school, so I changed schools halfway through. Um, and that woman who ran that ended up becoming the principal of the main high school, and I, uh, imagine it's probably a lot better now there, because she's, like, the, like, the nicest woman in the world. She's, like, really great. Use sound to your advantage. He's attracted to noise, so you can play audio to lure it to different rooms. I, s I saw that you want to keep them in camera 7, 8, or 9. Okay. Well, right now he's at nine, so I'll keep him in seven, eight, nine. And then it says always seal the the vent by him. Um, how do I go? Oh, a. Um. So you could seal that. 
Oh, I understand. So you're trying to seal the vent that's near him so he can't get through. Yeah, so he has to go around then. I think Jill might have just Hello? unsealed it too, though. Mm, uh, I sealed uh, this one. Oh, okay. There's a ventilation area, meaning you're gonna start. Ex uh, you're gonna start seeing Balloon Boy if you don't fix that. Jeez. Okay, that's fixed. The other thing I was seeing was that. Um, yeah, you want to use the sound to try and keep him as uh, away from you as far as possible, but he can only hear so far away. So if you're more than one room away, like if he's on, like, say, camera 8 and camera 5 was two away or something and you play it there, he probably can't hear it. Oh. So it would be a waste. Okay. So you want to play them in the rooms that are one within him. Um, so you just need to keep checking where he is. Another way to do it is that you can... Also, seal the vents as he moves from room to room, or he can get closer to you easier. He might not just leave the room he's in, he might crawl through the vent right to you. So you have to be careful. Do you think on... I should keep 11 sealed? I don't know where he is. Or should I do 12? Well, it depends where he is. Did you see him? Um, hold on. I'm sealing 12 for a second. I'm pretty sure he's... There he is. He was an eight. Oh, he was? Yeah. Background. Where? Right in the background. Oh. You can see so his now legs. he left. Oh, he so left. Now he's gone. So make sure whatever is so, attached to So eight. go to, go to... Oh, so, he's in nine now. Yeah. So seal now seal the vent. 11. Yeah. So now he can't get out that way, so he... So go back. He can only go to ten. Now or, he's... He moved. Or eight. Maybe he's in ten. No, he's not in that. He's Sounds like he's in the vent. He might be trying the vent. <laughs> But he can't, because it's sealed. Right. Okay. <laughs> How did he get here? I don't know. He went through um, the vent. vent. He went into camera 8's room, and then he went through camera 12's vent. <sighs> that wasn't sealed. He didn't go through camera 11 like we thought he would. Well, this is really difficult. thought this was supposed to be easier than 2. That's what I thought. I mean, we are getting to night three on two. Well, let's just skip ahead again. Until we get closer to like 2 a.m., okay? Once you close off the vent at Cam 15, it'll have to pass through at least one other room before it can try to pull a disappearing act. With the vent sealed, its only choice will be to hang around for a while or start making the way to Cam 5. And if it leaves, you can play the audio to lure it back. You can always lure him to cam four and seal the adjoining vent where he gets stuck for a bit, apparently. At least that's what it implies here. You should reboot your systems right away, or right after luring Springtrap into a safe-ish room when it goes out. If you see Springtrap at your door, try to get on the camera. It won't always work, but you can simply stare it down. But you can't simply stare it down forever because the inevitable ventilation shut down. Is that rebooting? It might make it stay on longer. But if you can get... No, it, it won't. Oh. It only matters when it goes down. Oh, okay. So I'm an idiot. No, no, no. I... Hi. But ventilation you want to fix as soon as possible. There he is. Cam 9. Yeah, so he can't get in through cam 11. So now you have a video error, so you have to... You have to heal. Did you guys plan that? Do reboot all. Did you guys plan that? He was on Cam 9, then he went to Cam 11? Was that like a secret joke? No, no. The Cam 11 is the vent that's attached to Cam 9. Got it, okay. Wait, did Scott Cawthon plan that? He was like... Is Scott Cawthon, is he related to George W. Bush? He like, he puts Are you guys like of, unlocking a conspiracy? He like puts a bunch of hints about like George W. Bush doing 9-11 in here. Yeah, he's just like, well, I mean, camera 9 and camera 11, they're connected. Yeah, I, mean, and I don't know. I what what don't if we put a jet I mean, in like, there? What if, just for the sake of, what if, for the sake of the argument, we donated the Trump campaign Ooh. so they can make Freddy's great again? <laughs> what if Scott, like, just puts, like, a... Hi. He puts, like, a like a couple towers in, like, one of the rooms, and then he has, like, Springtrap play as, like, a, like a person from Afghanistan. Just, a, I just picked a random country. Do you guys see Springtrap in this at all? He oh, was in there. He was in there? Yeah, I think so that's why he went out. Maybe he went to Hello. five. He might, might be on five. No, he's not there. Him. Is he in? There he is. There he is in nine. He's in oh, nine. Oh, okay. He's good. in nine. Well, you have to keep on him. 
Yeah, get on top of this. Get on top of spring trap. Can you seal the vent or is it already? Wait, now he's already gonna move. Sealed. He's gonna move. Where is he at now? It's he was probably went, He probably went to ten. You think so? Or four. He's somewhere. I mean, he had to leave. There he is in eight. Yep. Eight. Well, you don't oh, want to play. I... He's already in that room. Yeah, you don't want to play it where he is. Then he'll just know it's fake. He's gonna discover our secrets. He's not gonna discover the. He's secret. gonna discover who did nine eleven. <laughs> he's gonna figure out it was George. Do it. You have Hello. to repair. You guys are yelling a bunch of directions at me. Quick, go up, left, go, fuck go all right. Trap. <laughs> Is Five this gonna reboot? At Freddy's 34. <laughs> what? I'm glad we had to call like the tech support, and they're just like, they're just like, hello, can we fix your computer? That sounds really racist. <laughs> it's not racist. You have to call India. They don't have anyone who works in America who does it. That's racist. It's not racist to just say they outsource the jobs. Wow. <laughs> Outsourcing. Plus, plus, I was uh, I was mimicking a poop. Oh, so not racist. Yeah, got it. Watch where, this. Where is he? Watch this. I'm just gonna show you, like, just. He's a nine. If I was racist, I have that sealed. If I was racist, I'd go like this. Hello, Hello tech support. But because I'm not racist, I'll go like this. Hello, tech support. Okay. See, that was a poo. Right, right, exactly. You're just reenacting. Well, he yes. could be in a different room. He's, not He's a, a nine. nine still. No, that's him. Yeah. That one's he sealed wasn't still. Nine? Yeah. Oh, you're at 5 a.m. Nice. That's the amount this of set for This is epic. Can you now he throw left. him away? He left. Oh, no. Is he in here? I don't know where he's, he's at. He's not there anymore. Check 5. No one else was in the room where it happened. I don't see 5. What? <laughs> that was a, a Hamilton reference. You like Hamilton now? I hate Hamilton. I, I just see you referencing Hamilton. Because Hamilton is my god. Do I have to walk back the fact that I made a joke about, like, tech support? No, I mean, everyone knows that tech support is outsourced because these companies in America are too greedy to pay anyone from America for this. True. When they can get, like, cheap labor from other people that don't know what it's like to have money. So they, so they like, abuse the system. Sorry, I went off there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice! Hey, hey, moving on Does from that comment. Does anyone else want another, uh, car? <laughs> Sure. These companies in corporate America are ruining my entire sense of wealth and self. I wanted those tech support I jobs. To be a tech support man. Oh, oh, hey, I'm playing a mini game. Oh, 